Hi, everybody. I'm Miss Lisa. Welcome to the Upper Sandusky Community Library's Craft for Tots and Kids Craft 2. This month, we're doing Lucky Dragonfly. So if you get out your craft kit, open it up, and you should have three pipe cleaners, a couple of eyeballs, around 16 beads, and two glue dots. And the cat tail is optional. Most of you know by now, my cat fingers has to be in all the videos. Now the first thing you're gonna do is take one of the pipe cleaners and fold it in the middle. Try to get the ends together and that way you'll be able to fold it right there in the middle. If it's a little bit off, don't worry about it. It's not a big deal. Then you're gonna take that folded part and you're gonna just start sticking the beads on there and slide it up to about an inch or so away from the end. And just keep doing that. And doing that and doing that until you get to the very end where the pipe cleaners are folded. And you're gonna keep doing that until you have just two beads left. We're gonna save those for something else. So you can see at the end, I left just a little space at the end, not even an inch. And now I'm gonna take another pipe cleaner and I'm gonna put this one in a circle. You're gonna cross the end so there's about an inch at the end and you can fold those around so they're kind of tightly attached. Do it for one side and just wrap the pipe cleaner around the other side. And then you're going to squeeze it down together so it'll kind of look like wings when you get them evened out like that. Then you're going to slide it over the two ends and you're going to twist that pipe cleaner a couple times on one side and then you're going to twist it the same way on the other side and then you can adjust your pipe cleaner so it looks more like wings because when you're twisting them they kind of get all bent out of shape but you can shape them back up and then you're going to stick a bead right there on there and with that'll make a little spacer and then we're going to do the exact same thing again with the the other pipe cleaner where you're going to fold it around on one side and then bend the other end around the other side so that they're nice and tight. And you're gonna do the same thing. You're gonna push them together and then put them over the ends up next to that bead. And then you're gonna twist it two or three times to make it tight on the dragonfly's body. Do it on one side, straighten it out a little bit and then do it on the other side. And then you'll pull them out to shape them up a little bit to make them look like pretty wings. And then you're going to take the last bead. And you're gonna stick it down over those top things. Now those kind of look like antennas, but we're gonna take and roll them down a little bit and maybe sideways. I pulled a pencil out and that kind of helped me to roll that down a little bit. So you can see what I did here. Now you don't necessarily have to do this, but if you just want to fold it down, that's fine too. But it made a nice little ring for what I want to do next. There you go. Now I kind of turned them a little sideways and now I will take I'll straighten my wings up a little bit there. Now I will take the glue dots. Now I put some wax paper on the other side, but you still kind of got to force it apart a little bit. So you just pull them apart. It's kind of hard. You might have your mom help you with this. Just pull the paper off of them. It shouldn't stick too bad. It's wax paper, so pull one glue dot off at a time, get it on your finger and roll it around until it looks like a little boogie stuck to your finger. See, it's very, still very sticky. So you wanna do that because the glue dot is way too big for the eyeball. So you have to roll it around a little bit. And so you're gonna pick up the eye, one of the eyeballs and put that little sticky boogie back there on the back of it. And then you're gonna stick it to one of those pieces of pipe cleaner on one side that you rolled up. 
it'll give you a place to stick it on. You can twist the eye around any way you want to since it's wiry. And then you're going to do the exact same thing for the other eye. And there you go. You have your lucky dragonfly. Now you can stick him in a potted plant or just hang him from the ceiling or do whatever you want with him. And this is the last craft video, at least for a while. We're going to take a little break for the rest of the summer and get ready for gearing up for our programming in the fall. I hope you've enjoyed doing the crafts as much as I've been enjoying showing the crafts to you. Keep your eye out on our newsletter and on our Facebook page and our website for upcoming events for all ages. Thank you and we'll see you soon.